Hello friends, I want you to listen carefully so you could find out more about today's topic. Today's topic is the sense of touch and the parts of the body that help, help us touch and feel things. The sense of touch or feeling is something you use almost all the time, whether you realize it or not. You are using your sense of touch right now. In fact, your body knows whether you are sitting on something hard or soft and whether you are cold or warm. Remember that every sense has its own body part. You see with your eyes, you hear with your ears, you smell with your nose, and you taste with your tongue. But what do you use for the sense of touch? If you guess hands or fingers, then you are partly right. Your hands are the two body parts with which you touch things most of the time. However, you can touch with every body part of your body. You heard it right. Every part of your body that is covered with skin has a sense of touch. Skin refers to the outer layer of your body. Your skin is able to feel because it contains nerves. Nerves are like tiny wires running through your whole body that carry messages to your brain. If you get too close to a fire, the nerves send a message to the brain that sometimes that something feels hot. If you make a snowball with, without wearing gloves, the nerves send a message saying that something feels cold. If you have any ticklish spots like the bottom of your feet, those are ex also examples of sensitive areas. Although you feel something with every part of your body, some parts of your body have more nerves beneath the skin than other parts of your body. So you feel more with those parts. We say those parts are sensitive areas. Your fingertips are very, very sensitive. You can use your sense of touch to feel the texture of things. Texture means the way the object feels when you touch them. To describe texture, we use words like soft, hard, wet, and dry, or smooth, bumpy, and rough. For example, a feather is soft, but a rock is hard. Your sense of touch helps to protect you and to keep you safe and healthy. Thanks to your amazing brain and the complex web of nerves throughout your body, your body has learned to react to certain types of feelings. If you have touched something that was too hot, chances are you will, you will remember and will not do that again. Sometimes you are ready to go outside and play, but then someone calls you back inside and says, put on a coat. If you go outside in the snow wearing only a t-shirt, then all the nerve endings under your skin will become very excited and sensitive. You will feel cold. You need to put on extra clothing, clothing like a coat and hat and mittens so you can, your skin doesn't feel so cold. Nobody likes to get a mosquito bite. When a mosquito bites you, you feel an itch. The nerve in your skin makes you feel itchy. The pain you feel when you get a bee sting or other injury is your body's way of warning you to be more Careful next time. How many things can you feel right now, friends? Share with your parents different things that you are feeling right now. 